Okay, so that was it. That was the exercise. It may sound a little weird to you at first, uh, but sometimes those dumb, weird sounding exercises are important to practice over time because it actually enhances the muscle inside of your hand. Because once you start playing this, your hands are definitely going to feel the burn. So you may be saying, why even play this exercise or why even waste time practicing it? Because most times when you're playing and when you first start playing, the finger independence is such an important and crucial thing to conquer because when playing bass, your fingers are going to be weak in the beginning. And I still do this exercise to this day. It doesn't matter what level you're on, but if you're a beginner, I strongly suggest you do this exercise daily uh, just to strengthen your fingers because like I said, you'll feel the burn once you start playing this. So very simple. I ex I'll explain it. It's not too much to explain really. So you're playing one, two, going down the next string, one, two, going down the next string, one, two, going down the next string, one, two. So I'm starting the exercise on the E string all the way down to the G string, and I'm starting on the note A. But you can start this in any key that you would like. You can start it in F. Uh, the only difference is the frets are spaced out a little bit further, so it'll be a little bit more of a stretch when playing down here versus up here. So next part, the second finger actually starts this part. Two, three, two, three, two, three, two, three. You're following the same exact pattern that you did in the beginning. Next pattern, three, four, three, four, three, four, three, four. Very simple, right? So you're just using that four finger or four finger per fret rule. And you're sticking with those positions for your fingers. So one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, two, three, two, three, two, three, two, three, 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 four, three, four, three, four, three, four. Simple, right? On the way back down, I like to actually descend this because descending, actually reversing it as well. So you're starting with your four, then the three. So before we did three, four, now we're doing four, three, four, three, four, three, four, three. And then I want you to jump back down and start from the top again. But you're going to use the fingers that actually coincide or that correlate with those frets. Okay, you get it? So. I'll go over descending it as well. So here we go. One, two, three, four. And make sure you're alternating on your right hand or your picking hand and just making sure you're using that good habit uh, so you don't develop a bad habit just picking one finger. So if you notice, it's a little tough to keep your middle finger or ring finger down. And that's common for most people. So if you see your hands kind of, you know, floating up here, just kind of try to <laughs> control that as much as you possibly can when playing on your fourth finger, your fourth finger and your third finger are your weakest finger. So to compensate for that, you want to lift up those two as an anchor uh, to be able to press down firmer with those two fingers. So just watch that because you'll actually, you know, expend your energy and waste more time because you need to have your second finger come down, you know, pretty fairly quickly and then two one two one two one two one very simple keeping the same exact thing but if you do this constantly if you do this repetitively you're going to feel that burn and the same thing with ascending as well you're going to ascend start from the top ascend because I don't want it it'll actually be easier if you do ascend da, 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 and then come back down da, 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 da. it's actually easier that way that way you don't have to do any jumps I want to challenge you do that jump play that jump it, it's actually uh, like I said more challenging to do because you're skipping strings you have to think a little bit further or a step ahead of where you are so the next level, I want to, this is mainly a bonus, but the, the next level to this exercise that I like to add on to it is different positions, different phrasing. So you can do one, three, two, four. And those are the two combinations that I like to do and add to this exercise. It's going to work the same exact way using the four finger rule. So the same exact concept applies. You have one, three, one, three, one, three, one, three. Then come back up to the top. You have two, four, two, four, two, four, two, four. All right. And on the way back down, you're going to do the same exact concept we did before. Four, two, four, two, four, two, four, two. Jump back down. 
So I want to put this all together to show you the actual exercise just to see how it sounds even though it doesn't sound that great but it actually works. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Now descend. So that's the exercise in its entirety. If you really want to challenge yourself, try to double that up. Let's do that. Let's try that. And I'm playing at 130 BPM right now. And you can actually play that and challenge yourself to go faster and quicker and quicker, but remain clean, clear, and precise. If you guys have any questions, make sure you write down in the comments below. If you're looking to enhance your bass playing to that next level, the Bass Nation Academy, DerekBennett.com is where it's at. I'll put the link down in the description or I'll put it somewhere here on the screen or in the card or something like that. Anyway, you'll be able to find it. You get more opportunity, more feedback from me, uh, more lessons, live stream classes, all of that good stuff. I won't talk about it too much. Go check it out, free trial down in the description. Also hit that notification bell icon so you don't miss anything that we upload from week to week. Have a great holiday if you're watching this around this time. Anyway, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.